welcome to Village Pilates YouTube series. Today I'm with Linda Kragowski and she's a fellow um, student here at Village Pilates Studio in Oak Park, Illinois. And we're just going to ask her a couple questions today to just kind of get an idea of how she got introduced into Pilates as well as what's kept her commitment and just passion for the practice. So welcome Linda, thanks Thank for you. joining us today. Sure. Um, and first of all, can you just tell us how you were introduced to Pilates? Okay, um, actually I took Pilates mat classes for many years, um, but the joke was always at the health club is that if you're hungover or tired, then you do a mat class because sure. it was not a hard workout. Oh. And then one time I took a Pilates mat class with an instructor that was working here, and it was a whole other story. It was very intense, and um, she taught me so much about the parts of my body that needed work. Um, she's like, you're good in the front, but your whole back is a mess. You know, you need to get strong in your hamstrings, you need to um, do better with your flexibility. So it opened my eyes and she taught me that um, I should come here and use equipment and that would be a whole um, different level of experience and a whole different way of seeing Pilates. And since that point, I've never thought of Pilates as a baby workout anymore. <laughs> but it's a good workout, I said, whole body. Um, and then how long have you been doing Pilates? Um, I've been coming here for about a year now. Okay. Does that, and then what about your other practice when you first started doing Pilates at the gym? So would you say you've been doing it for about two years? Yeah, or? something like that. You know, off and on. Okay. I really never thought the mat class was all that great other places. This sure. place is the best. The teachers are certified. You have small classes, so it's very individualized attention. People remember what you put out on your uh, evaluation form regarding your body and what you need to work on. And um, you can't cheat, you can't get away with it because you guys watch us like hawks. Yes. So it's like, you know, okay, you know, you're slacking here. You really need to get going and do your whole body into the exercise, which I love. It's a very efficient um, exercise method where, in fact, you do use your whole body if you're doing it right. Absolutely. And then what's helped you keep your commitment or just that ongoing practice? I think because. Um, a lot of things. You see results. You know, people say to me, oh, you lost weight. And I'm like, mm, not really. But, you know, everything's shifted into better spots. Yep. Um, and you feel stronger and more uh, able to function. Um, you know, I always had problems with my knees. My knees don't hurt me anymore. Um, so you get results. And it's fun. And it's educational. I learned things like where my psoas is, where my PC muscle is, where my occiput is. You know, things that I never heard of before. And that I really enjoy body as well. Um, and then also, what would you say your favorite apparatus is or piece of equipment or maybe exercise just to kind of give us a little idea of where, where you like to be when it comes to being in this field? Um, I love the chair, mm -hmm. which is something I never heard of before. Yeah. Um, I came here and I like it for um, a lot of reasons. It works through balance all the time and as you get older, balance is one of the first things that kind of goes. You know, so you do that. It also helps strengthen the muscles around my knees so that my knees don't ache. Um, you know, and there's just a lot of different things you can do. You don't get bored. It's not like you're going through ABC every time, you know. And um, the teachers always give you good image and metaphors um, so that it helps you really do the exercise properly with the right form so you get the benefit. Absolutely. Um, and then also, can you um, tell us would you say that Pilates does help you in day-to-day -day activities? And if so, can you give me an example? Sure. Um, with Pilates, there's a lot of twisting, you know, mm -hmm. rotating around your spine. And my favorite thing to do outside of, um, you know, here <laughs> is uh, golf. Oh, I love right. to golf. So since I started Pilates, I got my first hole in one. Yeah. Uh, I'm not saying, yeah, thank you. It's directly attributable. But there's parts of it with sure. the balance and the turning properly um, and just the alignment of your spine. All that plays a big part in golf. So that's made my golf game better. Um, little things that you know the teachers care you about that if you have good posture, you're sitting with your head against the um, in your car against your um, headrest. Yep. And I'm like, wow, really? Nobody ever does that. Yeah. But now I try and do that so that I can get my spine in a straighter position and keep it that way, so that you're functional as you age. You know, and things are easier to do. So yeah, perfect yeah, example. Good. Yeah. Um, and then finally, if you could tell anybody out there who's curious about Pilates or anyone who is a practitioner of Pilates, just kind of any uh, helpful tidbits of information or anything you just kind of want to get out there. Okay. Um, I love Pilates for a lot of different reasons. 
one is it helps your flexibility. Um, also, the twisting. You know, I'm not a big massage person, but I've had massages, and I find this to be much more helpful than any kind of massage I ever had. You come out, you're unkinked, you know, nothing aches, and it stays that way um, for a long time. And it keeps you aware of how to hold your body, how to position yourself. Um, so it's, it's a very efficient workout. I like efficient workouts. Um, I like the fact that it, it's like the best anti-aging thing you can do for yourself. And you can do it the rest of your life. Exactly. And yeah, any place if you, I mean, that's one thing that I've always loved is just having a small place and you could just do a little mat workout and you're ready to go. And so, um, yeah, that's great. That's yeah, good. it's a good thing. Awesome. Um, so thank you so much for joining us today. And I know we'll see you at the studio soon. And thank you for joining us. And um, we'll see you soon.